What's up, everybody? My name is Cody Rattler, and welcome back to episode 7 of Mario Rabbids Kingdom Battle. Alright, my friends, we are going to be picking up in World 2. Of course, every time I save, it brings me back to this overworld, but you know what? No problem with that. I'm very curious to check out the amiibo real quick. Alright, you guys, I had to double check my amiibos to see which ones I even had. So, it looks like there's Mario, Luigi, Peach, and Yoshi. Um, oddly enough, I only have Mario and Yoshi. I don't know why I don't have Luigi at the very least. Luigi's like my favorite. Uh, and then Peach, I'm not surprised we don't have Peach, but let's go ahead and uh, start with my favorite Yoshi that we have. Yes, we have multiple. Uh, of course this Meepo is not supported. <laughs> Alright, I guess we're not going to use the, the pink wool Yoshi. Let's see if uh, my favorite Mario, 8-bit Mario, will work. Doesn't look like 8-bit Mario works either. I have one other Mario. Let me check that one. Alright, this Mario is the Mario from Mario Odyssey. Still nothing, huh? Well, what the heck? Alright, this is my last ditch effort. I have the actual Yoshi. I mean, there might be different versions of regular Yoshi, but come on. Yes! There we go. New amiibo content unlocked. New weapons. Look for what you have unlocked with the Yoshi amiibo. Both of those look really cool. Okay, so we've got a new weapon for... Oh, I get it. It's both Yoshis. It's Rabid Yoshi and the regular Yoshi. Spoiler alert, we haven't got them yet. Alright, so I guess it does have to be the regular ones. I tried Dr. Mario. I, I don't have normal Mario anywhere. Weird. Alright guys, sorry about all the distractions. We are back to where we were at in World 2. I finished this puzzle. I unlocked the area down there. But before I go that way, I want to make sure to clear out... I guess this is going to be another puzzle, huh? Probably where Frozen Toad is gonna be. <laughs> oh jeez, it's a disco ball. Sherbet sure, Hoppa. All right, so we've got some frozen, frozen rabbits. Can I look at them? Oh, it's a disco ball we want to look at. I love that they're just frozen and ice. Alright, so really not much in there. That was kind of an obvious secret. I guess the only thing you could do is miss it. Alright, now we're coming back down to the main area, I guess. This area was blocked off before, so... Onward! No, we haven't found your husband yet. I don't think that I have done this one. I'm pretty sure this is new. Oh, it is new. Okay. Uh, let me see. So, yada yada yada, push that way, green will come over here, push that way, red, and boom, that was record time. Probably the fastest one I've ever cleared. I kind of like saw how it was done before I actually started doing it. Blastberry Swirl, so we've got unlocked a new weapon. Let's go ahead and uh, check that out. Alright, so Blastberry all around is way better, although we don't have enough coins! Oh, my heart aches. I don't even have enough coins to get him a better secondary weapon. My heart aches. I don't know where I can get more coins. But there's a secret. Please be like 300 coins. <laughs> Uh, now I'm just desperate. I guess I didn't really pay attention at all to how valuable coins really are. Underwear everywhere. This once majestic landscape now looks like a frat house thanks to those rabbits. This is a big old pile of underwear. Uh, but yeah, anyways. Coins. I never realized how valuable they were until you need them. Apparently this town ain't big enough for the two of them. Alrighty, chapter two, here we come. We're we gonna be introduced to some new enemies or just bigger playing field. That is a massive bullet bill. One sword freely, spreading fear throughout all the Mushroom Kingdom. Now look at him. Tangled in gaudy rabbit undergarments. What a cruel fate. We must restore the King Mushroom Kingdom to its original state. This poor Bill's dignity depends on it. All right, we can do this. We've got new enemies now. I mean, they're the same enemies, but they change in appearance depending on the world. And of course, we've seen that the regular enemies have abilities now. All right, cool thing though, this is just a get to the end. 
So we're starting off with uh, Rabid Luigi. Let's bounce and then end here. I'm probably gonna go ahead and just take this shot on him anyway. Critical and a burn. The thing we gotta be careful with the burn is that when they start running around, they can catch other things on fire, not just enemies. They can catch your teammates on fire. Oh, that's mean. I can't get Luigi to... I wish I would have seen that. All right, that's kind of bullshit, whatever. Uh, so as you can tell, I can't, I can't get further with Luigi. I was hoping to double jump like Luigi does, but might have to do that on the next turn. Okay, we're gonna get Luigi over here. I'm gonna hop across there. I don't think that I want to take him out yet, although we could probably steely stare it. Let's go. I'm gonna do the same thing with Mario. Oh yeah, Mario time. Also, I keep forgetting we have upgraded Luigi to where he can now do uh, increased movement speed, which everybody could have been buffed at this point. I gotta remember to start looking into that when I first start moving. Okie dokie. Oh, that was clean. Now he doesn't get to move, does he? Oh no, he will move. And then he'll stop. Okay, so we wasted Mario's ability. His ability won't go for the next turn, basically. Okay, so... Mario will jump over you. We're gonna get him over into this corner. Yo! Yo! Alright, then we'll do the same thing with Rabid Luigi. Uh, I really don't know what the best course of action with him will be. We'll just put him on this side of the wall. Huh. Alright, next up, Luigi. Wait, come on. Where's my move? Here it is. Ooh. Okay, no, I don't want to do HEP because I've already moved all my characters. Let's go ahead and get some sort of jump bonus going on here. Luigi gets all the way over there. Okay, now... I might be able to send the car his way, and if anything, it might provide a shield for us. I'm just spitballing here, but we're going to see what happens. Uh, and then Mario and Rabbit Luigi, it doesn't matter. I'm not trying to take any shots because I don't want that thing to get closer to me as is. I'll take shots on him. Ah, I forgot they can target the car. That's cool though, like I said, shield, the distraction aspect to it. Okay, now the car gets to go first. Yeah, we got the ink off on him. All right, now real quick, is there anybody that can get over to Luigi? No. I wish Mario had the double jump. Dang, that'd be cool. But we'll just, we'll put Mario at the halfway point. I got a feeling that uh, we're gonna want Mario under some sort of coverage for this next turn. All right, we can jump over here, get behind here. And then we're gonna have Luigi jump over that. All right, Luigi up here. And we're so close. Okay, let's have him... Let's put him behind this wall. I don't know where the enemies are gonna sprout up from, so giving him some coverage from these guys might help. Ooh, we can take the shot though. I'll kill that guy. Bada bing, bada boom. All right, can Mario go anywhere? Oh, wait, did Mario already move? Yeah, Mario already moved. Um, all right, let's end the turn. Okay, see, good thing I had that 50%. Uh, still wasn't enough, but it was worth it. Worth the shot, anyway. Oof, see, we saved it there. Oh, and that guy's got a shield up now. Oh man, they got some guys behind Luigi. Okay, how are we gonna do this? Uh, I have a plan. It's a weird plan, but we're gonna try it. 
We're gonna get Mario just to this random spot right here. I'm gonna try to bounce Rabbit Luigi up. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I think we might have won this. I'm cutting across the entire map by having two people up here. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. That was perfect. Four turns. I probably could have done it in three turns if I would have utilized Luigi's uh, boost in movement area. You know, we got our gold in 900 coins. I forgot that's how we're getting coins in this game. All right, so the question really comes down to who do I want to spend the money on? Because, God forbid I replace Rabid Luigi. I mean, this is a really strong weapon, though. So that's 10, 13, 30%, 10 with medium coverage. Let's just look at what this has. 20, 65, 30%. Ah, man. I think I'm going to do the secondary weapon first. Because his current secondary weapon is garbage. Which means the primary I still can't get until I got 830. Alright, let's look at our skill points though. Skill points! Alright, so now that we have this last category open, uh, we could look into area of movement, maximum health, uh, increase movement once coming out of a pipe, and more health from mushrooms. Alright, for Mario I've decided what I want to do is stomp range, so after I jump off of an enemy I can bounce further, so that's going to help. Movement speed is always good in that sense. Uh, let's see, let's give her her secondary ability. We still haven't given it. It's the same thing that Luigi has. Uh, she's got 10 left. Rabid Luigi. Increase the range of team jump, so that might be pretty cool. Yeah, let's give him the range of team jump. And then Luigi, 30 points. Also the range and team jump, why not? Now all three of my dudes can jump much farther. All right, on to what I believe will probably be the next puzzle. Oh, next section already, section three. Oh, before we go over there, we got ourselves a mini challenge. All right, here we go. I wanna get these ones first. Come this way, get these, hit that. Come over here, hit this. Oh no, I see, I see what I'm doing wrong. No, I got it. Okay, just barely. Well, you guys know that took me three tries, but due to editing, you only had to watch one try. All right, we got a new weapon unlocked. See, what's a little messed up is they make me work for these challenges, and then I gotta pay for the damn weapon. All right, carrying on to chapter three. Uh-oh, it's our two friends. Bowser Jr. is uh, very powerful with that rabbit in his possession. I see you escaped Spawny's offspring back at the tower. Well, don't waste time patting yourselves on the back. With Spawny at my side, you'll be the ones fading into oblivion soon. Then nothing and no one will be the boss of me. Hear me? No one! Meanwhile, his dad calls him. Look at his Bowser phone. Papa? Papa, I'm kind of in the middle of some... <laughs> you can hear Bowser screaming through the phone. No, I'm not throwing a party. I finished my homework. Well, most of it. <laughs> Spawny's trying to grab the phone from him. Yes, I took out the garbage. Okay, Papa. He's like, now where the hell were we? Come on, Spawny, we're not done yet. We still gotta defeat Mario and his dumb friends. Papa will be so proud. Papa's gonna wonder why you didn't finish that math homework, you little bastard. Okay, let's study this thing real quick. Okay, we need a block. Oh, I remember this one being a bitch and a half. Okay, here we go. Okay. All right, we got the red unlocked. And then I gotta come back around here and hit this green, right? 
That's how we do it here. Okay, and then if I were to hit this green, I think it probably just... Yeah, resets that. I'm just gonna hit it one more time because I don't really want to leave it undone. Alright, now... I can't get either way that way, which means I'll probably be coming out that way. And the next battle! Oh, what do we got here? Oh no! I mentioned these guys in the last episode, but these are like my least favorite! These rabbits suck! These dudes are called supporters, and they heal each other! God... Damn it! <laughs> okay, I gotta love their introduction though. Little bastards. Gotta hate these guys. Heal who heals who heal. Alright, so my suggestion whenever you have a supporter on the map, take that thing out. Take it out immediately. If I start focusing on any of the other ones, these things are just gonna run over and heal them. Uh, they'll trigger super effectives. Okay, gents, how are we doing this? Luigi's typically gonna be my last to move. Mm, let's see. I'm gonna move Rabid Luigi. I'm gonna move Rabid Luigi here. Okay, can Mario do anything? No, he can't. Let's take a look at Luigi real quick though. Yeah, itchy feet. Okay, so the only downside is that I've already moved. Um, but why not? We're just gonna use it. So now Luigi and Mario can move further. Which means I'm gonna hit you. I'm gonna bounce off of you. And I'm gonna... Damn it, I can't get up there. I'm gonna try to get behind the guy. Alright, now I'm gonna take that shot on... Wait, it's just... Oh, he's just a stronger... Yeah, let's try to take him out. Crit, baby! I love the giant ice lemonade in the background. Super slow motion. Alright, Mario can now come in. Finish the job. Bounce off this enemy. And double tag team with his brother. Yeah, buddy. All right, we can get 100% on this dude. So that's the thing, is I don't have to focus the supporter if I kill his teammates before he can get to him. Let's turn on Hero Sight. And then we'll go ahead and... So I can't hurt him with the rocket launcher, but I can try to blow up that stuff he's hiding behind. Oh, I can't even shoot the rocket. That's dumb. Okay, I guess we can't do anything. He put the rocket in his hat. Ooh, smart use of a shield. Get rid of my hero sight. Ah, we're well protected. I hate that support unit. Oh god, he's got a grenade! That did damage to both of us. Oh man, this isn't good. Alright, let's move Rabid Luigi over here. Okay, I have 0% and 100%. Or I could 100% here. So that's 34 to 43. Or the 45. Let's do the 45. We'll shoot that guy in the back. Ooh, we got the crit. Oh, and now he's ours. Okay, so we'll bounce. See if I can get Luigi to get the high ground. Yes, we can. Which, honestly, I kind of want him up here just to have the sniping ability. Somehow that's still not in range. But the car is. So the car is going to go straight down and try to do damage to the supporter. If I could ink him, that would be great. We got the ink off, ladies and gents. Yeah. All right, steely stare. Okay. Um, 
Let's hit him. And I guess we'll come over for the hammer. That'll probably be the best bet we have. Or I could just leave him be because he can't do damage to me with the ink on his face. Um, end turn. Oh, the bastard can heal himself. I forgot about that. All right, Steely Stare is bitch ass. What a punk. What a little bitch. All right, Mario, or Rabid Luigi, let's get your ass up there. Let's get right up in his face. We're not gonna use the rocket launcher. <laughs> I would blow myself up if that was the case. Yeah, see, I would hurt myself. All right, we'll see if we can do fire damage. Yeah! Oh, I'm on fire now! The cool thing, though, is I don't actually take damage, I just end up moving. See, I've taken no, I've taken no damage at this point. Uh, now let's get Mario up here, and let's finish this little BZ off. And that's a wrap. Yep. Gotcha. gotcha. Yeah. Guys, I hate supporters. If you can't tell by now, they're introducing more and more enemies, and the thing is... By end game, they're gonna have so many enemies in one single battlefield that oh, it's gonna be very annoying. Oh, we've got a new character incoming. This is awesome. First of all, we found Toad. This is not nearly as important as the next thing I'm about to show you guys. Uh, Toad's like, Toadette got herself lost. And he's like, Beepo's like, funny, she said the same thing about you. Did she now? Well, in any case, we better go find her. By the way, I'm going to pause. I can't do the Toad voice, but if anyone wants to see the Toad voice perfectly done, you guys should go check out Bobbylicious Gaming. I love you, Bobby. It won't be easy. The area ahead is very dangerous. But if you safely escort me back to Toadettes, I'll make sure you get an even bigger reward this time. We're not in the delivery service. We have more important work to do. I love when Beepo gets red and angry. Of course, I just thought you might be interested in this. Guys, it's Rabid Mario. Yes, there's such a thing. Couldn't figure out how to get it out of here. I'm not good with puzzles, I'm afraid, but maybe you'll have more luck. Hmm. I'll even carry it back for you, deal? An ally to our fight against Ballot Bowers or Jr. Mr. Toad, you've out or you've got yourself a deal. Ah. Alright, so little bitch ass Toad says he's gonna carry it. Toad's the smallest guy out of all of us, and he's gonna carry that thing. Alright, which means we have to solve a puzzle. I gotta imagine this is gonna be a very quick puzzle. There's only so many ways that it can go. And I've already explained that I'm a professional at the Pokemon puzzles. <laughs> I'm very curious though. Hmm. How can I get it right? here. If I can get it here, then I can push it down. Let me think about this for a second. Oh, I see. Okay. Sorry that took me so long. Dang. For you guys, it really wasn't any time at all, but... I had to solve the puzzle before finishing the puzzle. In my mind, I already finished the puzzle. I know how to get it across, but I wanted to make sure I could get through the red part. 20 power orbs. Can't clear this, but I don't know how I would. All right, let's get this puzzle over with. I know how to finish this. Oh, I guess it's super easy on the way out. <laughs> Somehow Toad's big old bobbly head. Oh, that's how we get down. Probably because we're not supposed to jump on top of the ice cube on top of Toad's head. All right, you chubby little being. Wow, you guys did it. Guess I gotta keep my end of the bargain, eh? I'll carry your friend here for a while until you can re reunite me with Toad. Eh. Are you sure you can carry it by yourself? Of course, I work out. Plus, my head's very well insulated. I don't even feel chilly. Well then, I suggest we waste no time in reuniting with your less directional impaired buddy. For the sooner we do, the sooner we figure out our ice... The sooner our ice-enclosed ally can join us in the fight against Bowser Jr. And let me tell you, I really want... <laughs> Rabbit Mario on the party. 
he's a beast. Unfortunately, we can't get Rabid Mario out of this ice cube yet, but let's do at least one more battle for the episode. All right, Escort Toad. This is gonna be tricky. I think I have to control Toad, too. He's unarmed, so he can't attack, only move. It's up to you to make sure Toad reaches the other side safe and sound. Enemies will keep spawning. If Toad takes too much damage, you lose. So this is less about kill all the enemies and more about how are we getting Toad here. Okay, where is Toad? Okay. Hey, let me guess, you can't bounce off of enemies. No, you can't. Okay, so we're gonna just see the best we can get Toad as far as possible. Um, let's see, Mario, you can come over here. Yeah. Rabbit Luigi, we can get you. Uh, we'll put you here. You guys see the trend I do by now? I usually have Luigi moving last so that I can boop, and boop, and then yeah, the only thing that scares me is that big guy. He might not be able to move close enough to Luigi for this. That's a double jump if I've ever seen one. All right, now I need to figure out how do I want to start taking people out. I'm gonna use hero sights because there's a lot of people on the map. A steely stare. Then, I'm gonna figure out how I can take out some of these guys. 50%, 50 percent, 50 percent, 50, and 100. Hmm. I don't have 100 on anybody, not even him. So let's go with the 50 on this guy first. The rocket launcher. Boom. Did our damage. All right, now, uh, Just wanted to see if there were any of them that I could 100% aside from this one. Um, dang, I don't want to do that because it'll actually kill him. Wonder if I can do this? Oh, hang on, let me see if Mario even has a shot. Now Mario doesn't have the shot on this guy, so I, my best bet is to use Luigi Sniper to take out this guy. Oh yeah, that's just how it's got to be. Okay, and then I got a 50% shot for pretty much all of those guys. So let's do that one right there. Yeah! Alright, now I'm pretty much done with my turn. Oh, clean shot to Toad. I mean, Toad's not covered. I wanted to get the furthest distance I could for Toad. Ah, we got the hero boost thing. Somebody start moving. There we go. Boom. Crit. And another crit. Oh, I was only hoping, but that's two beautifully done crits. Damn, it's a shame we couldn't actually push him off the map. Although we really screwed over his movement, which is great for me. All right, first things first. Toad, let's get you going, boy. Uh, let me think. I want to move Rabbit Luigi first since Toad seems to have that edge. Okay. I think what I'll do is I'm gonna move Rabid Luigi over here and try to pull him off of. Oh, we got shot. I forgot we had that movement thing. Okay. Luigi can hit him. Luigi will bounce off. And Luigi's gonna try to. I don't know. We're gonna try to, like, MacGyver this guy and pull him around. Actually, you know what? I don't even need to do that. I can kill this other rabbit over here. While still getting some good coverage. Uh -oh. Boom, that's a crit out of bounds. Whatever reason is not a golden shot. I still don't know what triggers that. But let's get Toad as close as humanly possible. And Mario, can you bounce? Oh, you can't bounce off Toad. That would have been great. So the thing you could do though is I think if I'm this close could I do the melee that's it's always so tricky And I don't know. Let's just move him here. I Would hate to put myself in the middle if it's just gonna ruin my chances anyways 
Yeah, see, I don't know if I would have been close enough. Uh, what do we have here? So we can do... I'm gonna weaken him in case he does survive this hit. And then... I guess Mario has the most health, so... Let's try to do increase 20% damage and kill. If it gets a crit, we've won. Uh, no crit. This is why we weakened him now, 20% less. Oh my god! Oh my god, that was a strong hit. That was the strongest single hit any one player has done to me so far in this game. I think. I mean, maybe the mini bosses have done a little bit more, but... Holy cow. Alright, enemy turn. Alright, so we had half and half, which is what I expect with the coin flip. Okay, where's Toad at? How are we doing over here, Toad? We can get you as close as humanly possible. You're still technically guarded. And then, I guess at this point, we can just kind of start bringing everybody back. Well, can, can Luigi do anything over here? Hit him. Uh, and then I guess... We can come here. Wow. The reason I wanted to come over here is, oh, I could actually 100% shot. Let's do that. Whoa. I was going to use the car. Same exact thing just happened. Crit off the edge. Okay. Uh, hmm. Let's just do the best we can to create a shield around Toad. And we'll take our shots. Fifty percent or fifty percent. See, the thing is, I imagine that rocket launcher is going to do more, but they're both fifty percent, so I guess not. Oh god, that's a supporter. You bastard. Oh god. Luigi's on fire. Alright, but that's that. You guys did your worst, and now it's time for Toad to finish this. Bada bing! We win! Time to play. Time to call it an episode. That's what, what he really meant to say. That's another gold. Perfect. Yo, we racked up them coins. I might as well just save it for when we get rabid Mario. Let me just see where we can venture forward real quick and then uh, we'll call it. What do you know? I did need to leave that the way it was. Saw that coming. Uh oh. Okay. This is going to be chapter four, and something tells me we're going to have to fight our way back. So, for the sake of uh, saving today's time in the. <laughs> Look at this circle that we're all running crazy. <laughs> Uh, we're gonna call it here. Thank you guys so much for watching this far into episode 7. I just want to quickly say that uh, it's very important if you guys are watching from the start to the end of the video because watch time is really what YouTube cares mostly about. If uh, my video has a larger watch time, meaning on average people are just sticking around longer, YouTube promotes that more. So in general, if you guys are making it to the end of the video, I really do appreciate it. Um, and just wanted to share that tidbit. I'm probably gonna start trying to push that out a little bit more near the end of my video so that I can kind of encourage watch time a little bit more. That being said, I really do appreciate you guys who've watched this far into the video. I hope you guys have a great day. I'm looking forward to seeing you in the next episode. And until then, adios. <laughs>